If you have a long list of add-ons that you use on a regular basis, you know the struggle. The site panel gets really crowded super fast. You can't even read the label sometimes when everything is squashed together. One option you are left with is to go to the add-ons window and disable the ones you don't need on this particular session. But again, you might need them later on, so you will have to go back later and enable them each time. But there is another option to organize the add-ons on the end panel. Today, we are taking a look at the latest add-on from Amendeep. It's called Clean Panels. This add-on helps you organize and categorize your add-ons in different categories and groups. To prevent crowded add-on workspace, hence the name Clean Panels. You can use pie panels, drop-down panels, or workspace add-on categories to customize your workflow. After installing the add-on and enabling it, you can see new buttons appear on the toolbar, and switching the add-on filter on will hide all your add-ons, but this is because you didn't set any categories. To do that, you can easily jump to the add-on preferences window, or you can hit the cog icon at the top right corner. Clean Panels offers three ways to access your add-ons, through pie menu panels, drop-down panels at the top, or the sidebar. To access the pie menu, you can use the hotkeys Alt-R. For the drop-down panels, you can select one of the categories in the drop-down menu. And lastly, for the sidebar, you can either select one of these icons that you can create from the add-on settings or use the pie menu shortcut. In each method of filtering, you can create multiple categories with multiple add-ons listed underneath. For example, you can create categories for lighting, rendering, animation, rigging, modeling, and so on, depending on the add-ons you have installed. Also, you can check the description of this video to have an idea about the Blender add-ons and categories. To add a category, just click Add New Category and create as many categories as you need. To list installed add-ons underneath these newly created categories, all you have to do is to click the plus icon and choose an add-on from the list. For the workspace and pie menu categories, you can even pick the icon for each category. Additionally, if you want to exclude some add-ons from this whole filtering process, you can add them to the add-on to exclude field. This way, they will not be affected by any of the filters and categories you set. The add-on lets you divide your favorite add-ons into categories of add-ons and assign an icon for each category. This way you can customize your workspace depending on the workflow you are looking for. You can also use Pi Menu to quickly switch between categories, which is great by the way. Furthermore, we have end panel filtering or workspace filtering, which is a more advanced option. By activating and disabling categories using their icons, you can filter only the add-ons you need. So if you are doing hard surface modeling, you can only filter the hard surface modeling add-ons for example. At the same time, by holding down the shift key, you can select multiple categories at once. Similar to workspace filtering, you can categorize your favorite tabs into categories and pin them on the top bar menu for fast access. Your drop-downs then will change as you choose your categories. However, there are some limitations that I found which I think can be easily fixed. For now, the panels cannot be dragged into another monitor. Also, the window disappears as soon as you move the cursor out of it. But to end on a good note, if you want a clear interface or if you get annoyed with too many plugins and add-ons that are activated to the extent that you cannot recognize them, then Clean Panels is the add-on for you. If you are interested, you will find the necessary links in the description. I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can also check some of our previous videos. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.